Picture it, a whole mountain of wasted food. That's huge. Food waste is what happens in our homes and in stores, restaurants, schools, and communities when we throw out food that could otherwise have been eaten. In North America, 168 million tons of food is lost or wasted every year. That's as big as a mountain, and it's really bad for the Earth. When we waste food, we also waste all of the resources that went into growing, transporting, selling, and preparing it. That means we waste valuable farmland, 7 million Olympic swimming pools worth of water, and enough energy to power 274 million homes. Although some is composted, we send the equivalent of 13 football stadiums worth of food waste to landfills each year. Food waste that goes to landfills creates methane, a powerful greenhouse gas that contributes to climate change. Everyone has a role to play in reducing food waste. You can help shrink Food Waste Mountain by wasting less food in your own home. If lots of people do it, it'll make a big difference. A good way to start is to figure out how much food your family already wastes each year. It's called a food waste audit, and all it takes is a container, plus a scale is handy if you have one. Let's measure the size of your family's food waste mountain. Ready? Step one, get an empty container and weigh it or note its size. Write down the weight or the size. Step two, for one whole day, put all your family's food waste in the container. That includes anything that would normally be thrown in the garbage or the organics bin. Step three, at the end of the day, right before you go to bed, weigh the container of food waste if you have a scale, or measure how much food waste is in the container. Step four, subtract the weight of the empty container from the weight of the full container. That will give you the weight of your daily food waste. If you don't have a scale, measure how much of your container is filled. Write your number down. Step five, multiply the weight or volume of your family's daily food waste by 365. There you have it. That's a rough estimate of how much food waste your family currently produces in a year. The size of your family's mini food waste mountain. Pretty surprising, huh? So, what actions can your family take to shrink food waste mountain? Easy. Make a grocery list and stick to it. Store your food properly to avoid spoilage. Make sure your plate is empty at the end of meals. Save leftovers so they can be eaten later or share them with a friend. You can repeat the family food waste audit every now and then to see how your family's actions are making a difference. To keep shrinking the food waste mountain, watch the other videos in this series. And don't forget to download the Food Matters Action Kit to learn more about food waste and earn badges. Let's all shrink Food Waste Mountain together. Save food, save the planet.